Okay. So yes, um, ha yeah. So having said that, yes, um, it doesn't surprise us at all that the fifty percent of them have BJP links. But I saw the number when the list, like you said, fifty percent. You have the social workers, which are BJP. You have the two BJP MLAs, and the remaining officials, as you understand, the district magistrate, the superintendent of police, are all people who report directly to the state government. So they are in no way unprejudiced or in no way unbiased. The issue is. Uh, they are saying that they've been released according to the 92 policy. Yes. Now every state, every state Vasu has its own remission policy. The most important fact to remember is we are not questioning the existence of the policy. We are questioning the exercise of that policy. We are questioning the exercise of the remission policy of the state, not the existence. The 1992 policy of the Gujarat government is a two-page document. It is a two-page document which does not take into account the Supreme Court. <clears throat> verdicts on this, and it is absolutely silent on the exemptions to the up to the remission. For example, the 2014 policy of the Gujarat government goes in specifically and says that exemptions to the remission policy are gang rape, are murder, etc. That's right. Even when you, even when you see the Azadi ka Amrit Mahotsav um, as part of that, people yes. have been pardoned, but even then, rapists, human traffickers, drug peddlers are exempt. That's so right. these don't come under the remission policy. So when you see this, and then you see that on that these that all eleven of them, and it is rare for eleven convicts. It is unheard of in a brutal gang rape and murder of of a child of fourteen people of the same family that eleven convicts can be given. Normally, you can have one getting for due to age or medical reasons or somebody getting mm. due to good behavior. But the fact. All eleven, eleven of them have been tarred with the same brush, and that they are all either medically ill, or you know somebody's wife is sick, or somebody's nearing seventy years of age. This is a country where Stan Swami died in jail without a zipper, if you remember. This 